At the northbound I-75 rest area in Wesley Chapel, just after 11 Wednesday morning, a custodian who works here discovered a bizarre sight. He called 911. Oh, they're on the northbound side of the building, all three of them standing in the nude, putting on suntan lotion. An FHP trooper pulled up to see three young women, nude, standing in the grass. They said they were air drying after showering. Walter Burns watched in amazement. Naked females standing on the edge of the building there. Walter watched as the women jumped in their car and took off. And the trooper lights and siren right after them. Didn't stop, went around wrong way through the parking lot and do not enter past the enter sign. They turned around and headed north on I-75. The trooper followed but broke off the chase. I got a car in front of me a trooper was chasing. It's a white Nissan. A retired cop called 911, tailing them as they got off State Road 52. Yeah, I'm keeping about 50 yards behind them. They, they know I'm following them, though. Troopers caught up with the women at this shell station in San Antonio. The FHP reports the driver tried to run down a trooper. A passenger came at a trooper with a metal bat. Another trooper rammed their car. They sped off again towards Dade City. Near Pasco High, a Dade City cop used stop sticks to deflate their tires. Then an FHP trooper rammed their car and tasered all three. And it all started with a midday shower at a rest stop. People with no clothes standing around, it's kind of unusual. The women, ages 18 and 19, are facing a slew of charges. In Wesley Chapel, Peter Bernard, News Channel 8.